John Farrell with the Farrell Law Firm. Today, we're going to talk about how to stress test your estate plan. But first, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We put out new videos almost every day. And make sure you hit the like button because, hey, every like helps. John Farrell with the Farrell Law Firm. To tell you a little bit about myself, I'm the author of Estate Planning for the Modern Family, and I was recently voted one of the top three lawyers here in Cobb County, Georgia, along with the law firm being voted one of the top three law firms here in Cobb County, Georgia. Today, we're going to talk about how to stress test your estate plan. So you've done the hard work of, an, of establishing an estate plan. Good on you, as they say across the pond. However, you still have serious work to do to ensure that the strategy you've selected will maximize your peace of mind and protect your legacy. Estate plans are living, breathing creations. They're not something you can set and forget. Your life can and will change due to new births, children getting older, and other shifts in the family. Perhaps changes in your, to your portfolio, career and business, and changes to your health, where you live, and your core values. Likewise, External events, such as tax legislation passed in your state or the development of a novel financial instrument, can throw your plan off track or open the door to new possibilities. Obviously, you want to do your due diligence without spending an inordinate amount of time noodling over your plan. Good enough should be good enough. To that end, ask yourself the following stress test questions to assess whether you need to meet with an estate planning attorney to update your approach. Number one. When was the last time you updated your will or living trust? Since then, have you had new children or gotten divorced? Have you moved to a new state, opened or sold a business, or just changed your mind about the type of legacy you want to leave behind? Especially if big, tangible life events have occurred, strongly consider updating your documents as soon as possible against all else. Number two, who have you named as executor or trustee? If you had to start your planning over from scratch today, would you still make the same decisions? If not, why not? Number three, do you have adequate insurance? Many people do not have enough insurance for themselves or their businesses. They also fail to name contingent beneficiaries. Make sure to get your insurance policies in order. Number four, how's your record keeping? Nothing drives an executor crazy like sloppy record keeping. Number five, when was the last time you gave your plan a thorough once-over? Even if nothing huge has happened in your life recently, if it's been over five years since a qualified estate planning attorney has assessed your strategy, schedule a time to meet. Identify any issues and iron out the kinks one at a time. That's really all we have to talk about today. If you've watched our videos for any amount of time, then you know what we do is we help people plan their estates. To do that, we've created a book called Estate Planning for the Modern Family. You're going to want to get a copy of this book, so I'm putting a link in the description below so you can order it online. It will tell you all about wills, trusts, powers of attorney, and the probate process. It also comes with a bonus. The bonus is if you have trouble sleeping at night, you can read it and it will get you right to sleep. So make sure you read it in the morning. If you want to learn a little bit more about the firm or maybe schedule a free consultation for yourself, Give us a call at 678-809-4922. That's 678-809-4922. I'm also putting a link in the description below so you can reach out to us to schedule that free consultation. All right, that's all we have for today. Make sure you subscribe to the channel because we put out new videos almost every day. And make sure you hit the like button because, hey, every like helps.